I want to talk a little bit here about this guy who's actually uh, describing uh, the Zumadians, uh, the Zumadian uh, flying sheikhs. Um, I kid you not, that's what he's actually he's talking about. So this cult is called, uh, is they actually are a sect of the uh, Middle Eastern pagan rock worshipping actually cult. I kid you not. And uh, the sect is called, this This uh, sect is called the uh, the Timowain sect or the uh the timowain uh the they, they call the big uh uh hair uh, uh basically zumaris uh, uh, uh basically timo means hair uh a wain means a big so they are they are the the, the big uh uh hair actually uh, uh sect they are considered actually the sufis and the uh, the Zumadian Islamists, the uh, you know the other Islamists, the uh, the uh, the Wahhabis, the Salafis, the, these hardcore actually uh, pagan worshiping actually uh, uh, motherfuckers who took the basically the rock the rock worshipings, the rocks worshiping actually uh, uh, to a to a different level. Consider these guys basically. Uh, they consider them actually uh, uh, what they could, like the, how they actually call each other's basically. Uh, 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 non-Muslim. I kid you not. That's what they actually they believe that these guys are grave worshippers, and that they need to be eradicated. I kid you not. And so, and they also call them actually uh, sorcerers. I'm not making this shit up. I kid you not. I talked about this. I, I think I posted videos about that. And so, what he's actually talking about in here is uh, he's talking about the uh, the Zumalian sheikhs who actually came over from the Middle East, uh, basically in the 14 in the 13 or 14 uh, century AD, who brought Islam to actually to Zumalia. How these actually uh, sheikhs were flying, I kid you not. And one of the sheikhs he's talking about is a, a Zumalian sheikh. He says called Sheikh Yusuf Mami. Remember, Mami is he calls it Mama in here, but it's he he he, he, he basically he calls it Ibn Mama. So I don't know what that is, but there is a demon called the Mami. It's associated with the Mami Wata. It's some kind of a, a, a mermaid, and it's these basically uh, these Apkalus, these Oanas, these basically aliens that come out of the sea. I can't you know. I t talked about this uh, basically a uh, demon actually multiple times. Uh, and many of their songs are basically uh, are about these Middle Eastern Arab demons or parasites or these jinns that come from the Middle East. They come from the sea. They call they they, they say they, they they come from the houses of the Arabs. I kid you not. That's what they say in their songs. And so they say they they say these motherfuckers were flying, and some say they were actually coming out of the seas. I kid you not. That's what they say. They even they they have all kinds of basically yeah, what's called. Uh, hags and songs uh, basically for these actually Middle Eastern parasites. I kid you not. And so he says actually that he's talking about this actually uh, Sheikh. He says this Sheikh actually, this uh, Bami Sheikh was actually, or the son of Mami. He calls him Mama. He says he used to actually fly. I kid you not. I'm not making this shit up. He says he used to fly uh, and he says uh, uh, um, he used to fly like the uh, the insects. He says he says whenever Allah basically actually gave him his actually powers or his uh, uh, his uh, Allah gave him his power. I can't even what he says. So Allah gave him his power. He says so they consider these actually uh, these uh, entities, these actually hybrids or these jinn, whatever the fuck, the shape shifted basically Middle Eastern demons, uh, awliya or saints. He says when, uh, whenever Allah actually wants to actually make the uh, wanted to make these actually sheikhs fly, he would basically give them his power. He says and then they will fly. He says basically literally. I can't even know that's what he says. And he says uh, uh, that these actually these guys were flying. He says and he says also at some point they were also actually making big jumps. So I don't know what kind of jumps they were making. Maybe some kind of you know they were jumping out the Hulk or maybe uh, like they were their nephilims. But he says basically these sheikhs were actually were flying sheikhs, and this is actually well known actually stories because they'll tell you that many of these fuckers were actually flying. I can't even know you could see these actually motherfuckers like they have these they know the stories of the Solomons flying with the magic carpets and shit. I kid you not. And so many of these motherfuckers were flying and sh basically shape shifters and many of these motherfuckers were actually carriers of these Middle Eastern parasites and they were spreading actually these parasites actually uh, basically in Zumania. And what he also says uh, is that, that the Sheikh, he says, actually got his actually power or his actually uh, bloodline from the Sheikh Al-Kunin. 
al Khunaini is the one actually that actually uh, came in originally, the, the ones that the Isaq and the uh, claim uh, basically descend from, which is a lie because a lot of the action, nobody knows where these actually uh, Zumanis actually originated from. I kid you know. And so this al Khunaini is the one they also say is, you know, created the Walashma dynasty, all these basically, uh, the Ifad, the Adal, all these actually dynasty actually uh, 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 Zumanians came from. But they're not Zumanis, the Arabs actually. And so they say that actually, uh, you know, the, they say that uh, the, the use of al Khunain or the two, uh, the, uh, the, the Khunain is the two universes. Nobody knows where that motherfucker actually came from. But they say that that actually guy lived for 500 years. I kid you know, that's what they believe, that he, they believe he actually he lived for 500 years. And remember, they tell you Muhammad only died for, like, basically, Muhammad was like yeah, 60 years. He only lives of, uh, for 60 years. But that Zumani and al Khunain use of al Khunain, they, they believe that he lived for 500 years. So I don't know what that motherfucker was. But many of these motherfuckers, I kid you not, many of these motherfuckers basically uh have basically some kind of a jinn jin bloodline these 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 are basic these jinn these parasites they even their shakes even tell you that many of these motherfuckers parasites came from the middle east settled in zumani and then they were creating hybrids many of these motherfuckers were even they had even some they had even some kind of basically areas where they were actually built uh basic enclosures or cities and they would create hybrids. That's what they would call the Hatta Sheikha. And then they would actually uh, uh, unleash sheikhs or whatever they, these hybrids or whatever the fuck these mother are basically parasites from these uh, the areas. And they would spread them basically to the inland and tell them go proselytize. And they will come next to actually to the people who lived in it, basically in the interior. And then they will spread their Middle Eastern parasites and infect them. They will also chase people with these actually Middle Eastern parasites. What they call the basically the black magic of the basically uh, black and set off but again they call their black magic actually uh, miracles i kid you know this is what this actually sharia demon called these pagan rock, rock worshippers she called their uh, black magic they call it uh, miracles and they call their demons angels i kid you know and so this is what he's talking about and it is actually it, it is true they actually these people actually saw these actually flying shakes they, they were they, they were seeing these actually paris these motherfuckers actually flying crisscrossing basically zoomadia I kid you know, just like the, the, it's like when they tell you Allah comes to the first heaven, uh, you know, and he's sitting on his actually uh, 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 throne and basically crisscrossing the, the planet and asking people to actually, you know, ask him for favors. So they're not going to tell you these are basically UFO, these aliens or these genies, but they will tell you, you know, it's Allah. And nobody knows what Allah, what, what kind of Allah they worship. What What is even this Allah? I kid you know, none of these fuckers know it. But these uh, rock worshipping pagans basically are hiding parasitic they carry some of the most nastiest parasite on this planet and they spread it daily i kid you not it's a crazy motherfuckers